you're going to learn the best way to open a pomegranate. Aloha friends and welcome to Eating Richly where cooking time is connecting time. If you're new here, I'm Diana Johnson, a cooking instructor who loves connecting with people through food. And today I'm going to show you how I learned to open pomegranates from street vendors back when I used to do disaster relief all over the world. Grab a paring knife and then look at the blossom end of your pomegranate. This top part is the cap and you can see it goes straight and then drops down and right about where it drops down to the side is where we're going to score the rind with our knife. You're gonna slice across each flat edge just scoring the rind not cutting all the way through to the seeds. Now you can just score it all the way around in a circle but I like the method I learned in Malaysia where you basically crisscross at each bump to make sure that the membrane is completely scored through. Now you're gonna gently pull on that cap. First I go around the edge, just loosen it right up and then I pull on the top. It's so easy. Okay, we got it. We got a couple already. Now you can see inside where the white membranes are separating the pockets of pomegranate seeds or arils. Where those membranes are are the spots that we're gonna score the rind. Just like we stopped scoring at the edge of the top cap, we're gonna stop scoring at the edge of the bottom. Now you can gently separate the segments and pull out that center membrane. At this point, you can break off a segment and eat the seeds straight from the rind just like an orange wedge, or you can use one of two methods to release the seeds from the pomegranate rind and save them for later. The low mass method is to hold a segment underwater and gently pry the seeds out. The membranes will float and the arrows will sink so you can easily skim any white bits off the top, then strain the seeds. This method is pretty much mess free but does take some time. The more popular method, which I I was taught by a cook in Sri Lanka is to hold the open pomegranate upside down over a deep bowl and whack each segment with a wooden spoon. The deeper the bowl, the less juice splatter you'll have to deal with. Wear a dark shirt, it does stay. I prefer this method because it quickly gets almost all the seeds out and it's really fast if you buy pomegranates in bulk when they're on sale to preserve them to use for the rest of the year. As always, let me know in the comments if you have any questions or tips just remember, whether it's with me in the comments or out in the world, you can be real and be kind. And if you want to preserve your pomegranates to use throughout the year, make sure to check out four different ways you can do that, and I'll see you in the next video. I'm making it look way harder than it is because I'm trying to do it for the camera. I can do this. I'm gonna clean these up before I step on them. All right, we are gonna toss the cap. Sorry. <laughs>